I presume by calling this a quote warehouse padlock, the makers wanted to indicate it was more secure than a lock that was not intended to protect so much value. Unfortunately, that's not really the case. I tested the shackle, and despite it being fairly thick, it's too soft to steel to resist most cutting attacks. Another issue is the use of spring-loaded locking lugs to hold the shackle closed. That opens up a variety of potential vulnerabilities, including the use of padlock shims. Let me show you how these work. You slip them in between the shackle and the lock body in such a way that they push aside the spring-loaded locking lugs, then all you need to do is pull the shackle open. Let's do that one more time. Okay, folks, this is a lock that sells for over $50 on Amazon. At that price point, and in this lock's weight class, susceptibility to padlock shims is inexcusable. 